Hey everybody, this is Reviews and More, back with a quick one-year follow-up review. This will be very fast, like it'll be three and a half minutes long, and just to prove that I didn't put much effort into the timing of this, you can see my dirty kitchen, the can of chili in the background, and you know, just the general malaise in production here. So this is the Aki, oh sorry, before we get into that, please hit the like and subscribe button if you find this video helpful, it really helps out the channel. So this is the Aki brand, or Oki, or it's A-U-K-E-W, or sorry, K E A K. A U B B A A U K E Y uh, brand uh, air fryer, and this is a simple basin or bucket style air fryer, and it's got a little light with it. We're going to see it being tested a couple times on various items. It'll be French fries first, then a load of hot dogs, and the hot dogs were more because I was hungry more than for the video. And there's the interface. If you want to see a detailed review of this, just go to my channel, and I might put a link into the uh, either as like a card or just somewhere in here, just showing you what's going on with it, with the initial review, because nothing's really changed. It's still a very effective air fryer. The basin still cleans pretty well. It's not quite as non-stick as it was when we first got it, but that's kind of to be expected over time. And this thing was heavily used, and it is heavily used because it's still being used by me and and others in my home. But um, there you go. You just see them being used right there. 15 minutes for a set of frozen big crinkle cut fries. Took care of it. Um, you'll see the results. Very nice. Nice and steamy on the inside. Crunchy on the outside. The way you want french fries to be. But there's really not a whole lot extra to say about it. Except just to prove to you if you're looking at this. And you're like, I don't know if I want to buy this. I'm worried it might break in a year. It's still perfectly functional a year later. And it's relatively clean. And it's still very easy to clean overall. The main thing about it, um, the uh, the trivet that is inside has little rubber uh, feet for it that keep it kind of off the bottom. One of those has lost one of its little prongs, so it kind of sits in there kind of saggy. It doesn't quite go in the same way as it used to. But other than that, that's kind of a minor complaint. And some of the non-stick of that basin has kind of gone away with use. And I think just as it, that's going to always happen with non-stick stuff. So... Uh, Ideally, maybe if it were stainless steel, it wouldn't happen, but the heat transfer would also be a little bit different as well. So there you see the result with the french fries, and you're going to see me cook some standard uh, bright leaf hot dogs in just a minute, just to kind of show that it works and it still works properly. Uh, you're not going to see me cook a cake with it. If you want to see a cake being cooked with this, look at the original video from when this was unboxed and initially used, and you'll see me bake a cake in it. But um, other than that, it's still a very nice product, does the job very well. A year later, and I will say this, it was a year of heavy use, and I cooked every daggone thing in here. I was cooking egg rolls. I was cooking uh, chicken nuggets. Like, it was a daily ritual when I took my son, uh, my son home from school. It was chicken nuggets, french fries, chicken nuggets, french fries every single day. So this thing was used basically on a daily basis for about a year or so. It, it survived the usage. It is user-friendly. It's easy to adjust the time and temperature. And overall, really satisfied with it. Still a good part of the household. And there you see my mellow yellow in the background just to show you that I'm white trash. But um, there you go. There's not much else to it. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope the video was helpful. I hope having a one-year follow-up is helpful. If you want to see more videos like this, again, hit the like and subscribe button. It kind of encourages me to make more follow-up videos as time goes on. And have a great day. There's my hot dogs. Delicious.